do we have some familiar faces in today? I don't even know if my if I sound if you hear me. Yes, it looks like you can hear me. So who's in? First, I'd like to thank, I mean, yes, thank and welcome Gulem Lopez. Gulem Lopez, I hope I didn't butcher your name totally. Uh, welcome as a coffee supporter. And we have Joe, Dimitri, Juan Carlos, uh, Evgeny, Asim, Twisted, here we go. Audio okay. That's good. But the music, it was like, it's, it's like starting to lo loop. I have no idea why. And it's kind of random, so it's hard to figure out. Uh, Marie Dashkovska. Welcome. And there we have Joe. Exactly this. Some kind of acoustic feedback loop. It's very, very strange thing. It's kind of random. And I have no idea what it is, you know. But we have coffee. Do you have coffee, guys? <sighs> strong. Very strong. And Hakales is going to prep some uh, coffee. That's good. So who's in? The system is in. Yes, Twisted. Please, you have to put on your own music today. Because it does, doesn't work for some reason. I wish I knew why. It's very frustrating. But now I see I have some. There is something going on on that channel actually. Hmm. Do we have some? Uh, no music needed. Fedya, thank you. Ah, oh, there is never time for this, you know, to figure out what is going on. I wonder what's playing. Because I don't have any sound on. Hmm. Ah. Now I think I know what it is. Aha. Uh -huh. Sorry, guys. Last try. Come on, come on. What was the name of the playlist? How are you doing, guys? Who's... Is it... Do we have any new people in? I recognize uh, many of you. But what... Where are you to tuning in from? Fingers crossed for music. IQ, hi there. Uh, okay. I cannot talk and do other stuff at the same time. Open playlist, VLC player, and then we put on first track, and we hold our thumbs. No, it's more like this, yes. Music! But it sounds quite high. I like the music. You no, know, so boring to listen to me only. Now I know. Uh, I must lower the music a bit. Uh, 
uh, I see a question there. Question from uh, Dima. What video playing on your background? Yes, today it was... I almost didn't make it to put up this live stream. Whew. It was very close uh, to get back here to the studio and do this. Uh, yeah, now I it's the... Yes, um, it's the... A bit overexposed. It's the... Um, pat is it pattern photography tutorial pattern I think it's called it's a coffee supporter video I guess yeah it's the um, the pasta I shoot it's about shadows shadows 100% shadows IQ yes shadows video thank you uh, it's a very very important video I wrote because I think it is um, yes you have to check it out. Azim name Na no Aziz Aziz name. For once, I'm not too late. Keme Linux, M Jones. Hello, and maybe we should say welcome to. Maybe there's some new people joining. Um and. Uh, Thank you, IQ. This live stream, chaotic live stream, uh, we look at uh, magazine covers because we have a magazine cover challenge over at a Facebook group called, like me, Butvitson. Alex, what's up? Klee, hi there. And we yes, we have this uh, challenge over at Facebook. And let me see if I can find the... Let me see if I can find the group. This challenge brought some incredible photos. Twisted. Absolutely. And M. Jones, you didn't have a chance to download. I understand. Hi from Turkey. Tolga. Hi there, welcome. And let me switch to the other. This is the Facebook group. It's called like this, Botvidsson. Uh, you can find the link below in the description below this video. Then you can join. Because then we have this challenges I create like a fictional cover and then you use it as a template and then you shoot and make your own cover and now I see there is a lot of submissions here I haven't seen wow look at all these colors beautiful combination and you have the pattern going on here who's this from What is going on? Facebook. Maybe Facebook will crash also today. Uh, so you see here, this is from this is from IQ. Hi there. This is beautiful. Maybe we should start with yours. And there's another one. And you know, we will look through. Wow. Threads. This is a nice shoe photo. And you can, you know, in this group we post any kind of photos and then we, maybe you'd just like to show your work or maybe you'd like to have some feedback. So then we help out, you know, uh, to give some uh, feedback, maybe some tips and tricks, how to light stuff. So welcome to join the group, Botvitsson. I love how the live stream has the exact same chaotic energy like your videos. <laughs> Jacob, that's great. Uh, hello from Slovenia, Matej, Nilesh, India, welcome. So should we start guys? I think there's quite many covers, so... Chris, coffee supporter Chris, 
50 minutes late, but you know we haven't even started. I, <laughs> this was a lot of chaos, as always in the beginning, but now it will never happen again. Because now I figure out why I get this audio feedback. It's You can remind me next time if I forget. Uh, it's because... It's because I accidentally had a, in my browser I had a tab open with a live stream because I take uh, using the audio from the computer going into this mixer and then I can ha have the live stream because then it would be double feedback, you know. No one cares, but. This is there was a reason I cannot have a tab open with the live stream on this computer on the main computer. I can have it on this, of course. And we have Jennifer in. I think I saw Jennifer. Or yes, hello there, Jennifer. Welcome. And the system says mine, please. Of course, we will start with your cover. An output feedback. An input, you know. Whew. I used to be a um, bit of a music producer. You can, you can really not tell nowadays. Bro, sell me your shirt, Klee says. What shirt? This one. What do you mean? <laughs> so, system. Are you called the system in the Facebook group? Will I find you there? If I search... You should plan a sound session to fix it. Yes, but now it's fixed. Fabio. Fabio. Let's go to the Facebook group. Um, let's search for Fabio and let's take a look and see what, if we can give some tips and tricks for Fabio or if it's 100% perfect cover, okay? Fabio! Sorry, what was your name? Oh, there we are. Uh, there's a person who wants to join. We must let him in, but... There is no response. Christoph, you have to agree to the group rules. I will decline you. Request and apply again and answer yes to all questions. Okay? Let me see. Uh, <laughs> too many things at the same time. Fabio D. Fabio D, and we have purple cover. Look at this, guys. Boom. Boom. You can take away the that one. Dubstep. What do you mean? Is it dubstep on the? Maybe I just took the wrong playlist. <laughs> Dub step I don't know about. Um, the black one, Lee. You mean my T-shirt? Yeah. It's just a regular black T-shirt. What? What do you mean? Thank you, Juan Carlos. So, what do you think about this one? Do you see anything? Yes, you do. Um, what shall we say about this? I think it's very cool. <laughs> uh, I'm not so in love with the the green text. Maybe I should probably just go white. I often say this. Just go plain white, or 
go um, purple. Yes, very nice sheen, sheen, sheen. Shine, sheen. It looks like uh, velvet, or? <clears throat> but I think there is something going on with the... It's a bit pixelated. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But you know, clean, very nice. Maybe I should try to do something extra. You know, this time I was a bit... Uh, was going crazy a bit with the design. I, I by purpose I added a lot of text, big text on the left side. So you, I kind of want to force you to fit, to shoot for this cover. So the image will fit. You know, you have to have it on the right side. You can have something that will draw the eye to the right side. You know, it's a dress actually. Ah. A dress, nice. I just wonder how it will look with um, with the. Where can I find the? I need to take a look at. I need to find the magazine cover, the template, textile. There it is. And let me see. And well, let's go back. And let's take this one. I'm just thinking. I think it maybe. Or I will go crazy maybe and go like soft uh, purple. That's probably just me. But I think it will look, and also this one. Why do you only see half of the... There we go. But you know, it's very, very beautiful light on this dress. It's absolutely fantastic. But I probably would try to get, I don't know, maybe do something there extra maybe some extra light or extra wrinkle I don't know but you know fantastic okay let's move to the next thank you so much good job the system I should say Dan yeah Fabio Fabio and Fabio is actually co supporter that's why he has a green bean on the side of his name there. Don't you love my green beans I designed? And long you remember, it would change color. And if you remember very long, coffee supporter, it would turn black. We'll see. Masi, Miliano, welcome. Uh, Klee, do you have one? Let's take a look at Klee's. Now we will butcher Klee's photo cover. Um, ah, is it the shoe? I must say, this time, this template, it's, uh, it's a bit difficult. To work with you really have to but this is a good I think this is this is kind of good you know that you have it on the side there you have to otherwise the text would be totally not visual give it to me <laughs> I want the text white yes I will probably go white so it will match this a bit more but this is actually a bit more like cyan, a bit on the top there, maybe. I think you're going quite, pushing the light quite hard. Or maybe not. Clay. 
No, it's fine, of course. You see, here is like overexposed, should go a bit easy, you know. I will take it down just a tiny bit, you know. So we get all the, maybe a bit of the white, or maybe you need to do just a tiny bit, you know. Yes, it's quite extreme with the light, yes. But go easy with the with the power a bit. I think it's very cool with this box, you know. This uh, uh, Nike logo, have you added this one? Or what is this? It looks a bit uh, pixelated. Is it done? Is this the new Nike style? But I think it's cool that you have the box, but we have the focus on the shoe, of course. And if this shoe, if it's this is pure white in between this uh, pattern, then I would do it pure white. That's how it is. Wow. It's a new, new way of, the new Nike logo. Oh, okay, this real, that's great. But I think you have a dramatic and nice light on this shoe, you know. What if you flip the image, Phil says? How do you mean flipped? That the shoe is going the other way? Because if I'm only flipping it now, it will be behind the text, yes? But you mean that it should be like why 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 is this layer so big come on you mean if it's like if you flip it like something like this you mean that the shoe should be like that was it feel I don't know, maybe. Brush. Now it will look like a disaster, of course, but what is going on? Uh, brush. Hmm. You mean that it should be like this instead? Or that it should be flipped out so the box is like more ah there's a delay in the chat of course <laughs> yeah there this there is probably a dubstep track there so what are you saying guys is it composed Yes. Ah, feel that was the purple cover. So it's, it's is it a big delay here? I would do it like this. For me, my live stream is like three seconds delay. Maybe you should uh, update, reload the stream if you find it. Um, Slow. Please don't zoom in on my cutout. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Klee. I think it was cool. You and your shoes. It's very nice. Thanks a lot. We all love your shoe shots. Um, so... It seems a bit off focus and there is a bit too much noise in the browns if it's darker tinted somewhat might be better okay I restore thank you IQ um,
twisted. I was thinking about that one. Make the shoe a bit bigger for the cover. I think so too. Clee, I think you can could have it bigger actually. Because you have the megapixels, yeah? It's a bit tiny. It's better that you fill up this uh, dead space on the right side of the car, uh, on the texts on the left side. I would do that. I would do that. Twisted. Jim. Costanza. <laughs> Almost. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Search. Jim. Ca... Castan... Castaneda. Castaneda. Is it sort of correct? Must be this one. And we have... Is it ties? What is this? Now we have... Now it's placed on the right side. What is this cable? Ah, it's the charger for the iPhone. Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. What do you say about this one, guys? Uh, Ivan, hello there. Masks. Of course there is Corona mask, COVID-19 masks. That's uh, very, how do you say? Trendy photo, yes. My mother-in-law makes them. Oh, if you need a mask, you should check with, with um, Jim. Jim's mother-in-law. Joe loves the clarity of the colors. Yes, me too. It's very, it's very clear. Uh, exactly. It was noticed that it was taken for the cover. Nice work. Yes. I have not. I have. I don't. Oh, I don't have much to say about this one. I think it's nice. I, I actually I didn't first I thought it was like ties but then again when I look closely it, it cannot be ties maybe you should show with one of the masks that it is kind of a mask somehow it's kind of hard to understand at least for me that it is a mask if that's important to show that I don't know thank you I'm getting better at this twisted great um, okay beautiful colors yes so I don't have much more to say I believe it's an artistic concept Chris yeah Yes, it's not like a commercial shot, yeah. <laughs> the products ordered in good disorder, yeah. Yes, I hid all the hooks and ties, yeah, I understand. So you only see this colorful... Absolutely. Okay, should we move to the next one? I mean... Good light, nice colors. What can we say other than perfect? Who is up after Jim? Mine, please. Fedia. IQ was there also, but we go for Fedia first. First, Fedia. Whoops. Where are you? Is it this one? I guess. Yeah. Oh, this one. It's, this is cool. Now we're talking macro shot here. Don't just hit Command Zero F. 
Wow, look at this one. I like this one. But the first thing that pops to my head, why didn't you put, is it like a zipper, yeah? Why didn't you put it, why it goes in the center? I cannot get, you know, why didn't you put it here? Or it, it can, that you can turn the image, you know, and it goes like, the center thing I don't get, but it's so cool detail. And I love the blurriness at the back there of that fabric textile. Textile brutalism, yeah. It can create T with the title, yes. Colors are great. It's a nice macro shot. It looks like a spine when it's in the center, absolutely. But I would really, because this crazy magazine layout, you know, you have to really have to, you know, take that into account. That you. Because the text is very important, even if it's not important, but we are pretending that you're shooting for a, a magazine cover, you know. And uh, Juan Carlos agrees with me, thank you. But other than that, beautiful, perfect. Thank you, Fedya. And who's up next? I, Ku. Can I spell your name, you think? Wasn't it Ku Kura? Or maybe I should just search Kura, yes. Hmm. Well, well, where am I? What's my name? Can I go back home? Home. Sweet home. Search. Uh, is, that's your uh, last name, isn't it? Imtiyas, Imtiyas. Thank you. Oh, yeah, we looked at it, the first one. Totally lost today, totally lost. Bam, bam, look at this beautiful fabric. And I love that you, this is, this I like. Because he has, you know, it's darker over there, so the text, even if the picture is not dark, I mean on that side, <laughs> it's the opposite. No, yes, to the left side, you know, you, he makes it work, even if it's not dark on that side, may, probably it is, maybe, but then you can, you know, put on just a vignette or gradient darkness so the text will pop out and the text is the same color as the the this golden stuff it, uh, beautiful beige and the most important part embroidery there it goes comes in on that on the right side there i think this is fantastic yeah, a gradient layer. Because you need to think about the text so it doesn't just blend in, you know. I agree with Joe. Yes, this wrinkles, maybe... That would put it even a bit higher up. So you don't have these sharp wrinkles. And maybe down here I would work a bit in Photoshop, you know, just to clean it up a bit. This part, you know, I will go through the whole dress so no one will focus on the on that kind of stuff. But it's very hard to to fix wrinkles on fabrics in Photoshop. So I will really steam it or something. You know, 
And Lee is in the house. Hi there, Lee. Nice to see you. Förlåt att jag är sen. It's okay. We just started. So, other than this, I think it's beautiful. What do Jennifer say? Like the Carlson pattern. The only recommendation would be to remove the wrinkles. Yes. IQ. Good concept, well illuminated, but wrinkled. People don't like the wrinkles. IQ, you need to fix that. You have to use the iron. Maybe it's, it's hard to use an iron on this specific. I think you need to use a steamer, you know. Maybe you cannot use an iron on top of the embroidery there, and then it will be shiny and terrible, destroyed. Okay, thank you so much. Beautiful, fantastic. Very beautiful, beautiful colors. So who's up next? I wonder, how do I get back to the main page? Ah, uh, totally. Why don't I have it on the... When I search, I come to this. Do I need to go, like, back? So... Emil. Or Emil. Emil, what's your name? Are you Emil... Emil? Or Emil Lundström? I don't remember. Emil St. Oh, there you are. Maybe. Ah. Ah, this cool one. This is great. Why is Adobe 2020 icon question mark? <gasps> That's strange. Because I'm not using that, maybe. Remove. Okay. <laughs> Command zero F. This is very nice. I like this a lot. Francesca! Sublime. Francesca Longini. She was the winner of the previous... Previous challenge. Um, and... Um, Congra big congratulations to Francesca. And what do you say about this one? It's an Indian dress. Mm -hmm. uh, the previous one. IQ, this is one of my favorite entries. Yes, mine too. I like it a lot. Awesome. I buy it. Best one. Thanks. Carlos, we'll try next time. Yes. So good. I'm not sure if I love the fraying threads like like the concept. Fraying threads. Uh, I don't know the word uh, fraying, Jennifer. Fraying. I don't love the fraying threads you mean uh, it sounds like when you're fraying you... ah the loose around the you would love to have the threads clean nice without the fuzzy the fuzzy fibers yes mm. now they are kind of consistent I mean it's a bit more on the on the red one there on the top, but um, <laughs> and uh, Joe says, "At de är luddiga. They are luddiga, Jennifer. Frank, luddiga in Swedish. <laughs> Very funny word, luddiga. Um, I don't know. I don't know." Maybe it will be better without, or not. Maybe, maybe, maybe. But I like the concept. Uh, I'm not so sure about the text. It's a bit... Uh, 
how should I put it? It's a bit of a... It's a lot of colors. And the threads, it's a lot of co uh, colors too. So I... Mm, I would probably go for... What happens if I just drag this one? Oops, it's not 100%. Um, okay. But probably I should go with one plain, probably white as always, all the text. So we will focus only on these different colors on the threads because the text is like carnival lighting going on or something. And we have Maison Pain in. Welcome, um, one of our sponsors, and like to thank Maison Pain again. So, what are you saying, guys? Just for your info, there is a delay in the chat when I watch your live session on my iPad Pro MacBook. Nice in sync. Oh, that's bad. Maybe leave the middle purple thread one loose to break the pattern. Maybe, because the I would go probably without the purple one in the center. I like that it's like shh and shh. This is the center. You was thinking more like it should be like loose. I probably would take it away. I wonder how that will look. Now I should now I'm going to destroy your photo. Boom. Boom. <gasps> I just want I'm just curious to see how it looks. And then just white, plain white or soft text, not this many different ones. Maybe. I don't know. Because I love that they are like eh, stretched out and you can even... Yes, they are fine like this. I like it. Martin, put those text layers in a group and apply color overlay on the group. Much easier to manage. Oh, so I can... Um, so I can do them at the same time. You mean like this, like a, uh, like a solid color, or like this? Uh, how to do this? How to get the red? Maybe like this. Maybe I can just put this. No, I cannot. You mean like this? Yes. It should be clipped. Oh, doesn't matter. Thank you for the tip. Great. Uh, hi, everyone. Hi, EverTuber. Nice to see you. Learning something from Google Translate. Frey, trans, Franza say. <laughs> okay. Yes, exactly correct. It's not a word that you. When you know we have when you have old uh, some clothes that is old and they starting to. You see the threads, st starting to Franza, Franza say. Yeah. You're learning something new every day. Okay, this is fantastic. Um, Evertube, have you commented on my photo, Martin? No, no. There is so little time and so many uh, covers, so it's only the people who's in the chat we will have time to look at those covers. It's always been like this, probably also today 
45 minutes in. So, thank you. Where were we? And we have uh, Victor Schenholmin. Hi there, Victor. Say hello to to Daddy Krillan. Cause the concert is good, but. Uh, I mean, don't see the don't see the picture for the camera is in a way for the whole picture I don't I don't get it there Victor no I don't look uh, I don't watch the I don't have a TV anymore it was many many years ago Victor he's talking about Eurovision Song Contest for you in, in the if you're not living in Europe you have no idea what I'm talking about Yes, say hello to to daddy. Um, hey, where's the coffee? Rain over. I have a bit left. So. Color overlay from layer styles, but double click group. Color overlay from layer styles. Uh, double click double ah oh of course of course you're such a smart guy that's how you you manage the you apply um effect perfect thank you i will use this from now on thank you iq so where were we should we move on this is, um, I think this is a fantastic one. One of my favorites. Thank you so much. Next one. Who's up? Let's go back to search. Uh, what are you saying, guys? I'm here just as an observer and I'm glad that finally someone played with the text colors. Ah, yes. Um, okay, Marie, you like the colors that are different. Okay, I get it. Um, he's drinking Fanta. Yes, today I'm drinking Fantastic. Sponsored by Coca Cola. Yeah, right. <laughs> um, okay, Evertuber, let's go for your Fantastic shot. Basem, yes. What's your name in the Facebook group? Basem, Basem. And we have. Uh, what, what was the name, Jennifer? Fraid. Was it? Was it Fraid? Fraid thread. Or we can go Swedish. We have a. Uh, a bit of a, a thread that has fransat sig something I cannot even speak Swedish the thread tråden har fransat sig lite if that's correct to say that about the thread I'm not sure um, but this time it's not that much of a fraying going on <laughs> um, I think this is fantastic what do you say guys Um, dee 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 dee. Thank you. Yes, you're welcome, Emil. IQ, thank you. Eugene, we will look at yours. Whole bite lover, yours too. Um, that thread placement, 
so cool and satisfying for some reason. Yes, this is absolutely... It just goes exactly, precisely in between the I and the L. That's great. Um, very nice focal point. Indeed, I agree, Michael. Always speak in Swedish, Martin. Yes, but then you will... I will lose like 99.9999% of the viewers, yes. So that's probably not a good idea. But it, you know, I can speak Swedish. Maybe I should do have someone doing live subtitles or something. Coffee's out already. But then we have some some sugar to drink. Excellent, just a little jello, Juan Carlos thinks. This is my issue, not the yellow thing, my, the green thing. Kind of a green, greens in the shadows. I'm not personally a big fan of this. I told Basam this EviTuber before, but he loves this, he makes this lots in Resolve a film. Most it's actually a, it's like a it's a free software from Blackmagic. Um, it's a, ed, both editing and gradient software for film and um, you can also create this LUTs lookup tables and then you can import them into like presets and then you import them to Photoshop and add it on the on your like Instagram filter you can say but you can fine-tune it very much and you can you you can create them by yourself maybe we should do a video on this because it's kind of nice thing let me see And you... Where do you have them? Don't you have them here? Color lookup. This one. And then you, you import them into... And then you add them here. When you have, you have different... And then you create your own. So you can have the same style to add. What's going on? The winner in Eurovision Song Contest. <laughs> I couldn't care less, actually. Sorry for the Eurovision Song Contest fans out there. Um, I would, personally, I would go for, I would go for, um, you know, this green. I would just go for a tiny bit more red, personally. And maybe a tiny bit more of Juan Carlos. Was it Juan Carlos you thought it was too yellow? Maybe a bit colder than. You know. But this is just a personal preference. Basem, overall I love this shot. Good focus, nice colors. I love the text that you didn't go for some Christmas tree, you know. So, uh, are you okay with the green tone in the shadows? No, I mean, okay, I'm okay. If it, this is your choice, if you like it, you should go for it. Personally, I'm not a fan. That's why I'm showing how I would do it. But this, you don't have to listen to me, you know. You have your own style, okay? Yes, he's a fan of movie color gradient. Da Vinci Resolve, yes. That's the software. And it's free, but it's quite a complicated program for grading, actually, I would say. Can you fix that with selective colors? Selective colors is my, it's actually my favorite. It's this one. 
Um, and um, what should we do? What should we do? You know, you can do anything. It's very good to maybe. What happens if we go to greens? Do we see any greens here? Yes, there are some greens in the shadows, and then we can just go the other way. Now I will do extremely much here. I go magenta, and then we may might go a bit blues, bluish instead. Something like this, maybe. But probably we can go also to the reds and take away. Whoa, we can take away a bit of yellow because Cancados didn't like the yellow. You know, it's so. This is so personal thing. How you like to grade, grade your grade your <laughs> photos. You know, everyone has their own style. My style. How I do it now is just my style. I will go for something like this. Because that's what I like. Um, de -de 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 -de. My jacket, my hand. There you go. How do you take a shot? Did you? Sit like this. <laughs> Basel. Was it the Fuji color lot? I think he made it himself. Come Linux. Martin uses ACR filter and color balance. In Lightroom, it is also easy to color grade the highlights and shadows, midtones. Absolutely. Okay, thank you. Let's move to the next one. Bam, 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 bim. Yeah, I was not allowed to say bam. I should say boom. Was it you, Mats? Mats, are you here? Lumber jacket shirt. Yes, this is your style. Ma son pain. <laughs> so where are we? We have someone who likes to join, but someone helped him in. So, who's up next? Eugene. Eugene Bondar. There we go. And who? which one is yours? Is it the, the socks? <laughs> I actually have exactly those um, avocado socks extra point now I'm very thirsty I should drink water but instead I'm drinking sugar what can you do the first one the beige is is a winner ever Huber says okay so you don't think this one is a winner? And we have a coffee supporter. Christoph V or 5? Christoph 5. <laughs> it makes me smile but a bit busy. Chaotic. I agree too. It makes me smile too. I will probably go even more chaotic or less. I mean it's a bit random, but not enough chaos, I think. But it makes me smile too. <laughs> cool collection, Jennifer says, yes. <clears throat> Extra point, Cals, yes. John, hi there, welcome. Welcome to this live stream. We are looking at the textile textile um, cover challenge cover <laughs> magazine cover challenge yes that's what we're looking at right from laundry <laughs> great Ocean 
I have a got I have got a question regarding the challenge. Can I edit my entry, Photoshop the wrinkles and re-upload it? Yeah, sure, absolutely. If you like to. I mean you can do that. No problem. I mean you can you can uh, if you're on a computer you can actually click edit on your post and then you can replace the photo. So the comments and everything will not go away if you're creating a new one. So you can just re-upload the photo and no one will notice anything, you know. I love it and I wish it wins. <laughs> ah, which one was that? Was it Michael's or the one with the white wavy fabric? Okay, we'll see. So, should we move on? Thank you for this. It makes us laugh and uh, we may be a bit more... I will work a bit on the lighting so it's m more dark on one side. Smaller light source to get the focus on the, the right side. That's my tip. Thank you, very nice. Very cool guy. So let's go back and let's click search. And who's up next? Thank you, Dimitri. Don't forget to smash the like button. <laughs> Very kind. And we have Ivan. Ivan Rose Ivan Rose And do we have this one? Oh Look at this one Guys Ouch We need to look at this without me I guess And full black Go away Bye bye What do you say about this one guys? This is um, amazing, of course. Absolutely fantastic. Good placement and everything. And um, it's beautiful. Boom. Boom. Bum. But I saw in the Facebook group there were some discussions over there. Sorry. I need to send a message. And suddenly I cannot. Come on. It's important that you, you, when you're writing, texting, you must talk, speak. What happened? Why is it like a black screen? What is going on? But new, now you can hear me, yes, Jennifer? Okay, uh, thank you, IQ. <laughs> S 
Steam a st stream dropped. Do you know? Do you know why? When I go, when I was texting and putting back the, the phone, I hit the live stream off button. The on air I clicked off. Perfect. This is your style, button. Okay, sorry about that, guys. <sighs> um, so, let's go back to the Facebook group. Um, where were we? It was... Uh, it was... Um, what's your name? You scare us. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry about that. Um, let's see. Facebook group. And I was in Photoshop, I guess. Whew. Wow, so many buttons here. And why it's quite low quality on my stream here? How is it for you guys? Why, 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 why? Full HD. Now it looks good. Are you a guitarist? I can see it in your profile photo. Guitarist. How can you see it in my profile photo? On Facebook. Or what's my profile photo on Facebook? No, I think it's just this. Uh... Basem, how do you see? What do you see? Okay, I need to fix this uh, chat. Now it's chaos. <coughs> yes, there was some discussion in the group that this photo was like an uh, inspiration from uh, another photo. And it was. He, I think, Ivan. Uh, let me see. We should go to Facebook. So, first, mm, based on the rule of thirds, first, yes, I, if you look at the rule of thirds, the photo could be, I would go for the rule of thirds, I would place it like this, maybe like this. Now it will look a bit. Maybe we can do like this actually. I will really move this because I guess you have more photo. I mean, you have you can do whatever you like really. And almost if we take this woman and I will go for a tiny bit more onto this, maybe a tiny bit down, maybe, maybe, maybe. That what I would have done. what I mean Jesus. today today not much are going my way today that's okay yes rule of thirds that this the eye go straight to the red the redhead um, Ivan, I combined 20 photos into one, okay. I saw in the Facebook group, there was some talking about uh, this was inspired by another photographer. 
and um, that person thought that it was was not fair that you took that idea and uh, I don't know because I saw this photo and we can open it and you can decide this it was inspiration from this original photo yes Ivan is that true so this is the inspiration and uh, here's Ivan's photo if I should be completely straight I think Ivan's photo is better than the original actually I love this soft style no but this is the the inspiration I guess yes Juan Carlos I see you Great artist steel. <laughs> it is close, but better. Martin was just typing the same thing. Yes, I think this is, you know, this light that you wrote before. It's soft. It's so much softer and nicer. And you have this kicker on the back there. And the shape is nicer than the this original, you know, um, the the fabrics and everything. Everything is nicer. This is too harsh. And this is very soft and beautiful. It's fantastic. I like it a lot, but you have to decide if you think it's too, too, mu too much inspiration or not. There's nothing wrong in inspiration like this. I don't know. Ivan's photo is better. Yes, I agree, 100%. I think it's, you may saw a photo and then you turned it into something better. That's great. So much mood. Yes, this is absolutely fantastic. I really love this one. Um... What are you saying, guys? Maison Pas, so much mood. We all copy something or someone. I think it's a good photo. My concern is a religious one. Okay. I'm not so familiar with this. How, in what way it can be... Uh, I think this is about standing out, yes, from the crowd or something. And I guess it can be controversial in some countries. On a re religious point of view, I, I don't know. I copy me, Martin Boutvisson. <laughs> But I mean, uh, if it's a religious uh, concern, I mean, we live in a free world, you know, Basim. If you're like an artist, I mean, photo photographer, you have freedom to do whatever you like. At least in my, in, in this, in Sweden, <laughs> I understand it's not the same in, in all countries in the world, of course, but for me, it doesn't even doesn't even strike me. It can be some kind of religious thing, but probably it's because I'm from Sweden. I understand. But um, if you are inspired, I think maybe it's a good thing to write. I was inspired for this photo. I was inspired from this one because that other photo one prizes and kind of a big big thing big deal this photo the original maybe you should mention it i don't know what do you say guys but other countries is not that free i know but some of course mm. Okay, 
looks better than the original, but the composition is the same, yeah. So, shall we move on? Fanta however, fantastic shot. I must say. Let's move. Mind, please. Nile Nilesh. 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 What's it? S H. Yes. There we go. And what have you been up to? Oh, this is on, really on theme. Very nice, very nice. It's a bit blurry for me. I don't really have any sharpness anywhere. I mean, it looks like it's around the hand here, I guess. But I don't know why it's not really sharp. Maybe it's too small. Or, Milesh, how big is it? Is it 2000 pixels? Yes. There's something here, it's a bit, but it's, uh, it's in action, I get it. But I wish it was, it, it feels like there's more sharpness on the hand than on this, because this is like the main focus, I will put the focus here, so the, the, the hand starts to become blurry, I will probably do. Good colors, yes, looks like very good colors. The, the, matching and good colors in the shot but the focus I would like to have here silk weaving okay that's cool but other than that I don't have much to say often you get brightness you know the hand is kind of, kind of bright on the side here the focus is very much on the hand here I would love to have the focus more on this, this beautiful one. I think it's a bit too much focus on the hand there. Um, that's my only issue. Um, how to do this? So, suddenly I'm like... What if I... Can I... Change the white. Maybe we can take down the the highlights a bit. Change the highlight. So it's not it's like it's not in your face. 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 Maybe, maybe, maybe. Just a bit. I mean, so you don't have this super, super highlight there. What are you saying? The bokeh smear on the right side where the red, where the red meets the hand is a little strange. Maybe, yeah. Maybe not every photo needs sharpness. Chris, of course, full sharpness. Uh, no, ab absolutely. It's not sharp, but it's fine. I'm not into this sharpness thing. But the focus point, I think, should be closer to, to me as a viewer on this, not the hand. Uh, that's what I would have chosen to do when I take this shot. Thank you so much. It's absolutely fantastic. Deeper depth of field, maybe, but it probably it's not possible in that conditions. It's low light, you don't want to crank up the ISO, so... Who knows? Thank you so much for this one. Very beautiful. Who's up, who is up next? Yes, they're working in speed. It uh, can be good to show that it's... 
I understand. Mine, please. Whole, whole bite lover. Whole bite lover. First, some sugar. Whole bite lover. Um, here we have something beautiful. Oh, look at this, guys. Interesting. Oh, my, the time goes so fast. 87 minutes. Gee, we must speed up. We, I. My son kicked me in the face. That's good. Um, more beautiful color. Yes, this is absolutely beautiful colors. I love it. The problem is the text of this layout. <laughs> it's a bit hard. You really need to have uh, make it work for the cover. I mean, leave space there or some way. It feels like it doesn't really fit for the cover, but it's a very beautiful shot. Nice colors. It's like a flat lay with some stuff there. Flowers. It's, uh, it's nice. Reverse the image. You mean flip it, horizontal flip, yeah, twist it. Does the text need drop shadow? Uh, I personally, I don't, I'm not a fan of drop shadow, uh, but I understand, so it, we can read it, because now we cannot read it. So, from that point of view, we need a drop shadow, but I'm not a fan of drop shadows. It looks so 80s. 80s. Yes, very nice, but the text is barely readable. It's nicely done. A bit makes uh, lacks a bit of uh, clarity. Yes, it's a bit hard to get what it is about. I mean, you have this what is it called hanger for some reason there, and then we have a simple is beautiful text on some shirt and dress. What it's like. Hard to put your finger on what it's about this shot. And then you have this bags over to the left there. And you watch and it's a bit unclear, maybe. A bit bright. Maybe. Yeah, it's a bit overexposed. Can take go easy a bit. Probably will be better something. Take it down a half stop. Highlight. Probably something like this. So you watch the 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 whites, so it's not blown out. Um, like the concept and colors would fit well on the inside of a fashion magazine. Yeah. But we need more dead space, maybe a bit, I think. It's a bit uh, cluttered, busy for me. Lee! <laughs> Are you still up? It's a bit messy, yes, but beautiful image and colors. Beautiful, fantastic. Let's move on. Thank you so much for this. It's a very sweet photo, I would say. I like it. Soft and sweet. And now we must look at Lee, because he needs to go to bed. Sorry, Lee. What have you been up to? Oh. Teddy bears. 
Boom. Boom. Sorry. There we are. Fine, oh, please. Okay, soon. Sure, it's only 5.30, so you... Ah, 5.30 p.m. Yeah, where are you now, Lee? You moved, yes? Yeah, no, you moved. But 5.30? Are you in the US of A or something? I thought you were in, in, in UK, no? Sorry, I don't remember. All those bunnies. I like that photo. The spaghetti at the back is a bit strange. Spaghetti? <laughs> I think it's uh, gone. I'm in New York, 4.30. Is this a mountain with a river running down? Ah, forest. East Coast Canada. Ah, yeah, Canada it was. So is it like a forest with the bears and there is a mountain and a river? I, I didn't even, it didn't even cross my mind. Jennifer, or Jennifer correct there. Anthony, hi there. The foot is very busy. I can't stop at a certain point to cross the frame. Maybe, maybe so. I would, you know, I, Lee, I will move it away from this text. <laughs> Need smoke, yes. Where is the moon then? Anthony, first time here. Glad to get you. Yeah, you're welcome, Anthony. And you hope you're joining the Facebook group. You have the link below, so you can join. Sorry, now it's tobacco time. Um, the background a little bit brighter than the main. I mean, I think I would... I love the colors. Cyan, this river scarf. Cyan, bluish and green. It's, it's, it's such a Lee picture, I would say. But I would make, I would kind of probably flip it horizontally. So we have the mountain on the other side and we have all the stuff. Actually, the, the teddy bears would be, you know, I would concentrate it on the free space to move as much as possible away from the text. That's my only thing. The other one than that is very creative and it's very you, I feel. I immediately see that this is your style, you know. I, I, this is, you need to have a unique own style. Thank you. Yes, I'm in the group. And I have a picture entered for the Texas challenge. Oh. Is the group free? The group is almost free. It's like it's only like uh, $99 per month. But that's not much, yeah? Just kidding. I did flip it to get the teddy bears on the other side. I get it. Otherwise the, the, oh, is it rabbits? I thought it was teddy bears. <laughs> it's a uh, side chick. I mean, uh, <laughs> what am I saying? Side chick, side chick. It's a uh, rabbit. Um, of course, today I'm totally lost. Uh, uh, so, thank you, Lee. I love it. Fantastic. Maybe I would go a bit brighter, I don't know. But then it will be... Go... 
you know, but this is just me. Don't mind me. I will go something like this. But that's just me. Before. After. Christoph. Thank you, Lee. Fantastic, as always. Let's go home and let's go to Kristoff. We're running out of time. It feels like we have... I don't know what's going on. V? What's your name, Kristoff? 2F? What's your name in the Facebook group? Kristoff V? Three? At, uh, in the afternoon in Mexico, Christoph V, what's your name on Facebook? Side Chick. I think as I was trying to speak uh, Ukrainian. Side Chick. I think that's rabbits. Do you have still... Are you here? Um, Dima, are you here? Side Chick. Is it sort of correct? Side Chick. Chick. Check. Side chick. Rabbit. We could go a couple more hours at least. I know, we can go forever. Not much better, Lee. I just pushed it a bit, but it's fine. It's something like side check, yes? Dima, are you still, still here? <laughs> what did I miss? Terry is in! Welcome! Side chick is a mistress in use. <laughs> you have a, a chick on the side. That's great. First, ah, oh, there is no response from Christoph V. What is your name on Facebook? Otherwise, we have to go for. Uh, Arian. Arian. Why do you have to stop the broadcast after two hours, Martin? I know being exhausted is a main reason, but are there some limitations? No, there is there is no limitation. Um, but it's like, uh, it's a bit uh, tough to go more than two hours and I need to, I need to do some tutorials and I have a very, very limited of time these days. So that's why there is no tutorials coming up. If there's no tutorials, no videos, that means I have a lot of work to do, guys. Sorry. It's very hard to combine. It's very hard. Why is there a knife? Always a knife. Don't. Don't do this. Uh, it's very hard to combine having a YouTube channel and work and have a life. You know, that's... Equation doesn't, you know, it's impossible really. So I can only do videos when I'm a bit low I mean, uh, low. Um, not so such a busy period for for work. But I have a couple of big film productions going on right now, so I will. Um, I need to finish that first. Where were we? <laughs> so, um, we were looking at Arian. Kemeling, how to pronounce your name? Wh where are you f from, Arian? I say Kemelinux. Kemelinux. How how wrong is that? You say the K Kemeling. Dimitri, thank you so much. So is it uh, rabbit? Is it uh, Tsaychek in Ukraine? Nian. Side check, yes? 
sort of. Um, yes. Ah, no, that was the shadows. Belgium. Ah, Ariane Kemeling. Uh, where are we? This is yours. Finally, some ties. Anyone here work in IT? Uh, three weeks. Uh, otherwise, we should increase the contest time to three weeks. That give you a bit more time. Uh, yeah, but this live streams. This is just like a bonus thing. It's not the main thing about my channel. It's tutorials, shooting, lighting, and everything. This is kind of uh, just a bonus uh, thing. Stop hitting Command F. F. This is just live streams. It's just uh, some. Uh, we just having some nice time and have this friendly contest or challenge really for these magazines. It's just an extra thing, but I, what I'm focusing on on my channel is tutorials, of course. Lighting, camera, everything around photography. Uh, Christoph, wh what's your name in the Facebook group? I couldn't find you. Type your Facebook name there, but first... First, first, yes, it sounds almost right. Side check, side check, <laughs> side check. <laughs> this rabbit thing, side check. Um, ah, Christian Vergara. Guys, first, let's look at what was your name? Camelinux. <laughs> you have some ties. Perfect placement for the magazine cover. This is how you do a composite for the magazine, guys. Okay. And you have one. You're picking up the. It's like a, a nice. Uh, um, palette you're picking it up from the ties the text here like purple going to more over to pinkish reddish tone there that's nice nice and airy yes I like when it's I like this I not much to add oh looks fine to me Looks a bit like the. This one is a bit uh, on the side, but maybe it's not. Like it's not straight. No, it's it's nice, beautiful. Maybe a bit of cleanup on the. On the ties there. Maybe they are not completely new. I understand. But I would try to fix all this Photoshop, you know, it will not take that much time. If you know Photoshop, you know, take some five minutes just to... So the eye will not go to these tiny details. This, that's a bit disturbing. So what are you saying, guys? Don't think the short contest time is realistic. Realistic. In real life, you have only a few days to pitch ideas to come up with the concept. Yes, yeah, so that's a good point. Uh, 
Um, I did an overlay in the remote control tool. Remote control tool. What? What? Um, what uh, software is that? Because I know in Capture One, it's a great um, overlay tool there. I think you can do it in Lightroom. I have never tried it. Someone said it's not that good, as good as in Capture One. Uh, frequency separation is good to fix fabric imperfections. Yes. Probably it is. Um, you separate the, you have the, the pattern, the texture pattern is on separate layer, and then you have the, the colors, and you can smooth it out, and then you. Yes. Could it be slightly larger? Yes, I. I was thinking a bit by about that. It could, the ties could maybe start up here, and go all the way down, maybe. A bit slightly larger, I agree there. Sony Image Edge Desktop. Ah, so Sony, the the free software from Sony for Sony shooters. Image, imagine, Im, is it called Ima, Imagine Edge Desktop? Yes. I think the colors on the ties could be harmonized using selected colors. How do you mean there, Anthony? Uh, uh, um, so that they are that you're changing the tone of the... If you go to red, you mean that... You want them to be closer to... Um, so they're more like something like this, or... If it goes along... Like a purple, pinkish theme, yes? Or? Um, color theory, yes, that's very good to know. so much guys to blend the colors better these are my old ties the only ones that shine a bit <laughs> I get it uh, it's fine IQ it's good with the uh, discussions so, nice cover, twisted, yes, I agree, very nice. And who was up? Was it uh, you, um, Christoph, what was your name? What was your name? Christoph, Christopher Heidenborg, no? No, it's more like... Christian with TH. Christ. <laughs> um, there you are. There you are. Oh, it's this um, the baby, the baby thing theme. What to say about this one, guys? Here again, um, 
it takes the text there I will leave I will move the stuff on the right side make it smaller so you have a bit more you know if you're shooting for um, art director or something they just hate when you it's too cropped they love to have a bit extra dead space so they can do a composite for the magazine so if you're shooting for a magazine cover it's very good to have a lot of dead space so you can move it around and fit it in better because the text is a bit hard to read it becomes a bit busy here so these things over here I will move to this side and have a bit of dead space I would even move down so the textile the title here would be free just have this magenta pinkish background free don't forget me Anthony next one so I would love the saturation of magenta it blows too much for me low okay you will lower down the it's too strong it's a bit stronger on the live stream also it's a bit softer in real life um, but we can we can try to take it down we can go into here and we can we can do something color saturation <laughs> it always destroys the image when you try to take it down on the JPEG maybe a bit like this you see any difference on the live stream <laughs> maybe I should go in for uh, just uh, saturation yes it can, can be nice to have just a soft baby pink maybe mm. thank you Dimitri Camille, I do like colors if you like colors you should you should go for it you know and I don't think it's too much. It's fine. It's your choice. But it's very cute, yes. <laughs> Flipping the image horizontally, yes. I would do that because... Um, um, that would work better to have the text over here, you know. And um, let's take this one. Now it will look like crazy, of course, but if we go, we can change this. It should not be red. It should be maybe this color maybe a bit darker so we will see it something like this that would actually be better very good uh, good good idea because then over this it would be more visible and then you don't have all this and then you will see this better but it would be even better if you moved the the main object there to the right of course but it's great, great, great. Tulio, how smooth are you networking with people? How smooth? How do you mean there? How smooth are you networking with people? I don't get it. How I, in a smooth way, network with people? Is that what you mean? I never network with anyone. I knew I never do. Um, how do you say? 
commercial. I mean, I never boost myself anywhere. I never done this ever. That's why I never work, I guess. <laughs> Thank you, IQ. Okay, I think a lot of great tips on this one. Thank you so much. And now there was one person. Don't forget me. Can you type again? What was your name? What was your name? Was it you too, Leo? Who was it? Jose came up. But who was it before there? Somewhere up here. Uh, it's so hard to find you going back. You wrote, don't forget me. Anthony! Anthony, thank you. Anthony, what was your last name? There you are. There you are. Do you still have some music on? Yes. My favorite song just happened to. Okay, Anthony. Oh, this one I haven't seen. Must have entered late. Wow, there's a lot of texture on this crazy shoe. Beautiful. Playing with gels, I guess. Sorry. Perfect placement. And this is like extra bonus thing. The eye goes into the... I love this. Maybe I will try to make a bit sharper there. Maybe. I mean... One, two millimeters. Yes, the title is fantastic, the, the colors are fantastic. Maybe some will, will say it's not on theme, but I think it is. You know, this shoe is textile theme. And I love that you have this light highlight on this pattern here. This is beautiful. The only thing maybe it's not focus stacked, so it's kind of blurry down here, but you don't always have to focus stack everything, so everything will be in focus. But maybe in this case, I would take a few images, switching the focus so you will have the whole shoe in focus. Maybe it will look better that way. I will work a bit on the retouching, probably. So there is no, there is no, you know, you see this bit of scratches here. I will probably try to fix that. So there is nothing. Also, all these parts, I will probably make them look to fine. Um, yes, you know, I'm this crazy person I sit for hours in Photoshop and fixing every tiny detail so no one can ever tell me oh you should fix a bit in Photoshop you know and this is a bit uh, you see this I would try to fix every little, little something oh, even this part you know now it will look not so good because I'm uh, not doing a good job but this I would do I would even go 
I often zoom in like 200% because then when you look at it smaller everything is just smooth and nice. I don't know if this part is part of the shoe. I guess it's this. It's a different part here but this looks like I don't know. Maybe you need to brighten up this part. It's hard. But possible. What are you saying guys? Uh, this image is pleasing. I agree. Cool highlight on the sole. Middle ribbed area. Yes, Jennifer. Fantastic. Weirdest high top I ever seen. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Dimitri, the eye is fantastic. Martin, are you using the healing brush? Yes, I'm using the first one. Hello? Why can't I click? What is going on? I'm always using the shortcut, so I... Suddenly I cannot... Why can't I... J, the J, um, what is going on here? It's this one, um, and it's the spot healing brush, yes, I guess it's called, not the old one, this one, then you have to sample area you know so I'm using the the one that you just spot healing brush tool is it cool like this guys Photoshop experts so I just paint and then he uh, will do everything uh, create texture I haven't tried this new tools anyone try this I haven't seen this create texture content aware I often often use so he will do automatic create texture what will happen if I use that one I've never seen this before <laughs> doesn't look good at all hmm, interesting I need to learn on that Anthony, do you work as a photographer? Yes. Thank you. Beautiful shot. I really like this one. Beautiful light. So do we still have anyone left? Lives in Berlin. Anthony. Berlin, that's a great city. Do we still have some time? Two hours. Now it's actually two hours, guys. Do we still have some? Look at. Anybody we didn't look at? Textile, texture, yes. Yes, gels. He's using gels for this to get the colors in that shot. Jose. Gonzalez, no, Diaz. Jose Diaz. Um, from Spain. Hello there. But where is yours? Is it this one? Probably yes. And we have some threads again, but they are not Ludiga. 
That's good. Jennifer likes it when it's not ludit. Oh, sorry. Boom. I tried to get it in one shot. How did you make this uh, sky? That must be Photoshop or? How did you create the background there? Tell me, tell me, how is this done? It's very creative. And <laughs> the scarf there, and it goes out to all these different threads. I will go. I like that you have the title behind this sculpture. But I'm not in love with this Christmas tree going on with the text. It always looks more. How should I say? Professional. If you just use a very. I will go for white, you know. If you're in doubt, go for white or black. Maybe. Should we go for white? Or maybe a bit of softer. We can pick up a color from the statue here, you know. Maybe not that one. It has a bit different colors, this statue. Um, here is a bit of greenish down here and then a bit yellow and then a bit magenta. I don't know how you... What's, what is your lighting there? Uh, look, looks like gold glitter on a black cardboard. Yes, Lee. Yes, the white text looks better. I think so too. Um, maybe now it's like a bit magenta. Maybe we should go for a bit grayish. Because <laughs> you have all the colors down here. And I would love to, I would love the whole picture to be white or black and then only these threads and the scarf. That's the colors. Because there's a lot of stuff going on here with the colors if we take a look. You see on the statue there, from green to yellow to magenta to blue. There's a bit too much going on there. Um, so I will go, I will take down the blues maybe first. Already now I think it looks better to take, when you take away the blues. But maybe you like to have it on the background there, but the greens, you have green down there. I'm not a fan of that. Maybe we should not take, uh, maybe if I take, <laughs> I will take everything away. But you know, it looks like it's not, f you have not used flash, maybe it's like uh, a mixture of, uh, I don't know, constant light sources or, what light did you use on this one? I'm very curious to hear. And then we should of course have the, this would be very hard to fix now. But you get the idea to clean it up a bit. It will be a bit nicer, I think. And then you can have your, uh, you know, the eye behind there. So. I will go for this, like clean it up a bit so you not have millions of colors. Maybe it's not, now the, the, um, the text feels a bit, you can always have some kind of, you can choose one of course. Maybe not red. Maybe a bit of, uh, 
what am I doing? Why can't I choose blue? Normal. What am I doing? I have no idea. I think I will go for... Probably I will go for white, this grayish. So this is the main stuff that will stick out, the colors of the scarf and the threads. Maybe. Group is on the hue saturation layer. You're so observant. Ta Thank you, IQ. Cinematographer, yeah. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for this one. Very creative. Whoa, now it pops out. You know, maybe you should have the text should be orange at the top, but maybe the side can be white. Just an idea. So have we... Victor is in. Hi there. So have you looked at all covers? All the people... Are you here in the chat and we have not looked at your cover? Please tell me. Because now we are we're like over two hours. So did we miss anyone? I can tell you that I will look at all the cover covers and then we will find a winner maybe I will pick the winner maybe we will do a voting on the channel I don't know maybe I will pick top three top five I will say that and then it ends up like six ten <laughs> but I will pick if I find it very hard to choose maybe I will pick like should really stick to maybe six tops and then you can vote and then the winner will decide the next thing and if we have a sponsor if we have any brands out there who like to sponsor just like my son pain watches last time that would be great you know it's so nice to have a prize then the motivation will be higher to create something, you know. <laughs> so... Victor, Yatsuk, Yatsuk, do you have some... Um, did you uh, put in some... Uh, let me see, can I look at all this? There's so many great covers we haven't looked at. I like this one a lot too. Brandon. I just wish that, you know, again, this is not shot for the magazine, probably. This one, you can move everything tiny bit to the, just a tiny bit to the, to the right, I would say. This would be absolutely fantastic. I really like that one. And we have a lot of stuff going on here. See all this fantastic. And this is very nice too. Fantastic. And this is kind of nice. But I will go for move the model a bit to the right. So it's not in the center. It's almost more to the left. No. Victor, okay. Um, you're very welcome, Fedja. Thanks so much, especially going to sleep. Yes, good night. Sleep well. And this one, I think this is the first one from Davidas. This is cool. But I will look through and then I will pick out maybe between three and five. And then we can vote in the group, I think. I think it's more fun if um, we do it together. I will pick, you know, I will pick some, my favorites, so you don't have to vote for everyone. So, um, and then you do the final call 
which one should win first second third place okay should we close down guys today's it's a very long live stream two hours and 15 minutes it looks like oh my but as always it's very a lot of fun to look at all your creativity great idea thank you yes and thank you everybody else for your time and all your work on the covers and thanks for all the feedback thank you Jennifer so I will see you soon again in the Facebook group and hopefully soon in a new tutorial that's the plan of course see you later yes absolutely see you guys I will close down for tonight and uh, take care out there okay see you guys see you later okay